What is up guys, Dan K Memes here and we are back for our week 4 APA Wi-Fi Season 2 Battle. If you missed last week's episode, video, challenge, battle, whatever you want to call it, uh, go check it out because uh, spoilers are incoming. We lost <laughs> 1 0 again. Um, so we are 1 and 2 plus 4, which is uh, a, an irregular record, so the least. Uh, you, you won't see too many of those in leagues around the, in, around the world. Um, we need to bounce back this week. We really do. Um, but unfortunately, uh, as some of you will know, this weekend has been very, very, very hectic. It's my birthday today. It's my birthday. Happy birthday to me. Quick shout out, Marta, Elite Four Marta, some of you may know, who made this. Who made this for my birthday. Dan K memes, Pokemon cards, Sunflower memes. Some of you will get it, some of you won't. Um, if I was from Elite Four, Dan, love it. Fire type, obviously, because I'm flamey. Um, and let's let, let's let the battle begin. Um, yes, so uh, hectic weekend, hectic weekend. So I haven't had a lot of time to battle. I've had no time, or I had a little bit of time to prep, um, but I didn't actually have any time to actually get the Mons gened. So you'll notice that we are bringing the exact same team as last week. Now, Electivire is scary. Sneasel is scary. We you know we saw last week we had a bad matchup against Weavile. Uh, so the fact that Weavile, uh, Sneasel is here is very scary. Uh, Nido Queen is here, so we're just gonna pop Nido Queen on the layout. Um, and other than that, I think we got it exactly right. No, no Caesar. That sucks because we are still carrying a flamethrower on um, Togekiss. Uh, but it is the I completely forgot what it was that's come instead. It's the what is it? I can't I can't I can't see the screen. This is the problem. Hit one top. It's the hit one top. Um. Right, okay, so we have 50 seconds to decide. I think I think he probably leads Nido Queen, to be honest. I think he probably need, leads Nido Queen. So I'm kind of tempted. I'm kind of tempted to just lead um, Mill Tank. Or I could lead on the offensive. I'm going to lead on the offensive. I'm going to lead... I'm going to lead with... Mm, Scrafty could get the Intimidate off. That's what I'm going to do. Scrafty Intimidate. That's what I'm going to do. And let's go. Let's go. Scrafty Intimidate leads. Hopefully, I'm predicting either the Hitmontop or the... See, Needle Queen could lead. Electivire could also lead. Because Electivire threatens my team a lot. Obviously, um, gets Ice Punch. Um, it gets... Uh, also, like things like Wild Charge, um, which threaten my team greatly. Uh, we do have Electros for the Neo Queen, which is nice. It should wall the Neo Queen completely. Uh, this is the Beyblade, so it's the hit on top, so that's fine. So we're going to intimidate each other here, I think. Oh no, intimidate! Oh yeah, no, there's intimidate. So he intimidates me. Uh, I intimidate him. Uh, so let's get our calcs up. Let's get our calcs up. And we are going to look at Scrafty, straight edge the Scrafty at minus one against a a hit on top, which we are obviously weak to. We are obviously weak to. Um, so at minus, oh no, no, I don't even need to do minus one because it does it automatically, doesn't it? Oh no, no. Yeah, no, no, no. Okay. Right, so we do nothing. Oh, wait, that's level 100, that's why. Level 50. A close combat hurts us. Um, so, I mean, I kind of... I kind of want to... Hmm, I think I just switch out here. I think the smart thing is to just switch out to, like, Togabish. I think he goes for a Toxic, to be honest. I would not be surprised to see a Toxic come off here. Um, I would not be surprised to see a Toxic. So I'm actually... Do I outspeed? This is the question. I don't think I do. No, I don't outspeed. So, I think... There's no point in me going for a sub. Uh, I think... I, I'm sure the Toxic comes off here, but I have to go out and Togekiss. I have to. 
If it goes through a thunder, does does uh, hit one top get thunder wave? I think it does. I think it does. Um, I can see the toxic coming off here. Yep. Um, which sucks. It does suck, but we had to do it. We had to do it. Um. Now I am free to just throw off a thunder wave here. However, I do expect the Nido Queen to come out. I do expect the Nido Queen to come out. So predicting Nido Queen, I think I'm gonna go. I think I'm gonna double into Electros, predicting Nido Queen, because we do wall Nido Queen completely. Who draws? And we see the Cooking Mama, which is definitely the Nido Queen. Oh, it's, no, never mind. It's the, it's the Clefable. Um, which is fine. I'm going to throw off a Toxic here now. Uh, he could go out and see Nido Queen. Um, I'm going to actually... Electros. Uh, I just realised I am Assault Vest Electros with Toxic. I just realised I am Assault Vest Electros with Toxic. That is not good. So, we have a 25% useless um, Electros here, which actually sucks. Um, so, I think we're just going to throw off... We're going to throw off a Giga Drain. It goes to Stealth Rocks. So, we could have Volt Switched. We could have Volt Switched. So the Giga Drain did nothing. I'm just going to Volt Switch now. I'm just going to Volt Switch now. I think he probably switches out. Moonblast. Okay. So we have a slow we have a slow turn here. Right? We have a slow turn. So we take that pretty well. He knows, she knows that we are um, Assault Vested now. And I am just going to go into... I think I could go into Mill Tank. And get our own rocks up. I think that's the play. We are spe physically defensive, which isn't ideal. But I can see the hit one top coming out here. So, um, I'm tempted to just throw off a Thunder Wave. But actually looking at it, rocks hurts Salamence. It hurts the Sneasel. So I'm just going to go for rocks. I'm just going to go for rocks. The thing is, if hit one top comes in, he can just rapid spin. Um, when I when I say he, I'm referring to the hit one top. By the way, I'm not obviously I know Chris is a girl. Um, <laughs> just after that out there. Yeah, so the hit one top comes out. Uh, there's the intimidate, and we'll get our rocks up. Um, do I expect him to go for, her to go for a close combat? Do I expect her to go for to a close combat? Um, I want to see Miltank. The other guy. I'm going to hit one top. Um, do I expect a close combat? I don't. I think I expect a Toxic. I'm just going to Thunder Wave. I'm just going to Thunder Wave. Because uh, even a close combat does 45 to 50. 54% to me. So I'm just going to throw off the Thunder Wave as I expect the Rapid Spin to come out. All right, and we get the full power, which is lovely. So we do get a free switch into Togekiss now. We do get a free switch into Togekiss now. Um, so that is nice. That is nice. Oh, we are going to put 25% from Rocks. You know what? How much does a hit one top do to Cloyster? A close combat does 64 to 76. Oh, so that's a roll. That is a roll. I think I might actually go out and Scrafty, you know. I'm going to go out and Scrafty. I'm going to get this 
this attack drop off, right? I do expect the rapid spins to come out. But I can just go for a a substitute. Yeah, there's the rapid spin. There's the rapid spin. Which is absolutely fine. So now. Um What are we? What are we? <laughs> Dunno. Um I'm just gonna go for a sub. I'm just gonna go for a sub. Because I don't want to risk getting toxic. She can go for a close combat if she wants. Because I can just I can just sort of drain punch like the paralysis is pretty clutch. The paralysis is pretty nice to have. Um so hopefully we'll get hopefully we'll get a few more full powers, to be honest. Uh, just because you know it gives us a few free turns, lets us keep momentum a bit better. Um, I'm gutted that Togekiss got toxic, to be honest, but I think who draws, and so we get a free sub up. Here's represent the Salamance. So we are down to minus one now. Um, now I can just go for crunches. Uh, I know because I am. The ability should be intimidate. So actually, crunches don't do that much. If I let her set up here, this could be dangerous. Uh, this could be dangerous. Do I have Ice Shard on Cloister, just out of interest? I don't. However, I am... Hmm. This is tough. This is tough. I'm just going to go for the crunch. If she starts Dragon Dancing... Oh, she draws. She draws. There's a Cookie Mama. So, I'm at minus one, right? Which help does help... It's caused considerably. Um, against a Clefable. Um, a minus one Iron Heads. Does 22 to 27. So I think I can I can just get off a free... A free hmm. I'm just going to go for the Iron Heads. She ha they have to break my sub. She has to break my sub at some point. Goes to the Moonlight. Um, which is fair enough, which is fair enough. Right, okay, so that's doing decent damage, that's doing decent damage. Now, I'm predicting the Salamence to come back out here, to be honest. I am predicting the Salamence to come back out here. Um, it will just go for another Moonlight, to be honest, she can just go for another Moonlight. Hill bell, bell chime. So the paralysis on the on the hit one top is now gone. Um, but we're just gonna go up throw off another iron head. If we had bulk up, then she'd be in trouble. So that sucks to be honest that we don't have it. Um, I can't switch into cloister because cloister will will not take a moon blast. I'm fairly sure cloister will not take a moon blast. Yeah, no, I won't. Um, so I'm just going to go for another Iron Head. Just can I try and keep her low. I wish we had Thunder Wave or something. Ugh. I'm hoping for a crit, truth be told. Because a crit would destroy. A crit would destroy. So I'm just going to go for another one. I'm just going to go for another Iron Head. Withdraws. Here comes Salamence. No, nope, here comes the hit on top. Which is fair enough. 
Doesn't get the Intimidate because I am subbed. So Scrofty is just kind of sitting here, like it can do. Hit one top. I'm at minus one. Uh, I keep putting it at level 100. Needs to be level 50. I could just go for a free drain punch here. Get some damage off on this thing. Low kick. Okay. So low kick instead of close combat. Which actually does 22 to 28 to me. I know that's at minus one. That's a minus one, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so my sub is gone, um, and we have to kind of be a bit more aggressive now. Um, I'm sure she expects me to switch. I'm sure she expects me to switch. Um, how much does a low kick do to mill tank then? 30 to 36. So we can actually stall on that. So I'm just going to go into mill tank. He doubles out. She doubles out, sorry. Into Cooking Mama. Into Cooking Mama. So, um, this is fine. This is fine. We'll go back out into Mill Tank. we we'll take a bit of Rocks damage. A bit of Lefties. Um, and we are just going to get these Rocks back up. We're going to get these rocks back up. Let's see what she wants to go for here. Might probably moonlight. Yeah. Just get gets herself healthy again. And now, I, now I am just going to go for a thunder wave. I'm just going to go for a thunder wave. Draws, and what we're going to see here, probably the Nido, the Nido Queen would be the best one. Via for Prez is the Electivire. Now, this is dangerous. That's a really good, nice switch from her. Really nice switch. Motor Drive. Shit, I did not think about motor, motor Drive. And now this thing is dangerous. Uh, this thing is dangerous now. How much does a cross chop do to me? 42 to 50. Um, honestly, I think I just have to go for a body... I think I'm just going to go for a body slam. Get this thing as weak as possible. See what she wants to go for. Because this thing does take it on pretty well. Mill tank. Mill tank does take it on pretty well. And I don't think... She can't two-hit carry me. She has like a... Zero, like no percent chance to two-hit carry me. Unless she is... That's This is with a... This is with a, well, this is with a choice scarf. Now I wouldn't be surprised if choice scarfed um, Electivire because uh, ninety-five base speed. We see the wild charge here. So we are just going to go for a body slam. We we take that so well. We take that so so well. Um, now I don't want to risk the scarf. I don't want to risk the scarf. I could predict it and go into Garchomp, but that would be a dumb dumb play because she would outspeed me. Um, with a scarf and a plus one. So um, I'm just going to go for another body slam. I'm just going to go for another body slam. Um, if she did, if she, so if I did predict it. Then she would just outspeed me if she wasn't scarfed. Um, going to ask her. So she does switch out. She goes into the Beyblade. Um, and I am again. I'm just happy to throw off a Thunder Wave here. Um, and just kind of weaken this thing as much as we can. A minus one body slam doesn't do too much at all. Does not do too much at all. Um, we know a low kick does not do that much from from a hit on top either. So I'm happy to stay in and throw off a thunder wave here. I am happy to throw off, stay in and throw off a thunder wave. Mill tank is fat. <laughs> Mill tank is fat. There's the thunder wave. 
slows that blade right down and goes to the rapid spin. So that is fine. That is absolutely fine. And I think I'm just going to... I think I'm going to go back out and Scrafty. I think I'm going to go back out and Scrafty. I doubt very much that she stays in because you know, it's different to last turn because last time round because obviously she got the full power, so um, she had to then go for the rapid spin on this turn when I was switching. So I wouldn't be surprised to see. Um, I would not be surprised to see Clefable come out here. And I'm just gonna have a look. Uh, if I can predict that and sort of get Garchomp out there. Mm, Garchomp doesn't do enough for the Poison Jab. Does not do enough for the Poison Jab. Um, what do... Mm, honestly, I think I'm just going to go out to... Electros. I'm just going to go out to Electros. I can't believe I have Toxic and Assault Vest. I can't believe I have Toxic and Assault Vest. That means I had it last week against Jock as well. I didn't even realise. <laughs> uh, there's a Toxic. So I wish I wish we went out into Togekiss there. Um, but Electros is fine with that. Honestly, Electros is fine with that. And... I'm just going to go for a Volt Switch here. I'm just going to go for a Volt Switch. I mean, it does... The thing is, actually... Oh, this invites the... It invites the, the Evire out, which I, sh I really shouldn't have Volt Switched. Because he has two... She has two good Switch-ins. In Nido Queen and Electivire. I really shouldn't have done that. Electros doesn't do well in this match. Um, I wish I'd hard switched. I wish I'd hard switched because there's. If she does go into Electivire, this could be dangerous. Does withdraw. Cooking Mama. That's fine, then. That is fine. We take that. We take that. We Volt Switch. We Volt Switch. And now... I think... I think we can probably go into Garchomp and Poison Jab. But I don't want to lock myself into Poison Jab just yet. Um, let's have a look at Togabish. A Dazzling Dean does quite a lot. Or oh, I can just Air Slash, to be honest. I can Thunder Wave and Air Slash. Actually, well, I'm going to come in. I'm going to Wish Up. I'm going to Wish Up. Because she can't two-hit carry me. She cannot two-hit two carry me. Oh, but I'm toxic. This is the, the issue. No, no, I'm going to wish up because I need to keep this thing as healthy as possible. I'm just going to wish. She stays in, which is nice. Don't know what she wants to go for. A heal bell. So that's good that we didn't go for the Thunder Wave. Very good that we didn't go for the Thunder Wave. Get a bit of leftovers, obviously lose a bit of damage to Toxic as well. Lose a bit of health. Um, but we will go up to, up to full next turn. Um, so I am just going to go for... I'm just going to start going throwing off Air Slashes. Because there's 33 to 39. 
That did not do that much. We get the flinch though. Um, we go back up to full. We lose a bit to Toxic. But I'm, I'm happy to just air slash again. Because I don't want this thing to heal up. I don't want this thing to heal up if I can help it. With Jaws. What do we see here? The Rhapsody, which must be the Nido Queen. So this thing's fat. That doesn't two hit KO. Doesn't two hit KO. Um, so an air slash to a defensive Nido Queen does 35 to 41, which is about right. So, actually, unless she's got speed investment, she does not kill me. So I'm actually just going to go for one more Air Slash. Toxic Spikes. That is fine. Well, actually, it's not at all. It's not fine. Oh! Togekiss, why are you so blind? It's really not fair at this point. Really not fair at this point. <laughs> um, I'm just going to go to Electros. Because this, this, this thing would now almost be dead. This thing would now almost be dead. We take some rocks damage. We are already poisoned. Goes, she gets her second layer of toxic spikes up. Um, right, so, I'm just going to go for Giga Drain, get some health back. We have revealed the Giga Drain, so that stays in. Honestly, probably goes out into the Cooking Mama. Does withdraw. Via for Prez. So, there we go, predicting the Volt Switch. That's actually fine. Uh, and this is a two-hit KO now. I doubt Electivire takes us out. I doubt Electivire takes us out. Level 50 against our Electros. Our custom set Electros. Um, an Ice Punch. Nah. An Ice Punch doesn't even kill. So I'm happy to just throw off another Giga Drain, I think. Or a Flamethrower. I think Flamethrower... Is the next best bet. The cross chop comes in. We live on two. Um, so the elect the Electivire goes down, which is really, really big for us. Uh, gets rid of um, one of her main threats. And our Electros goes down as well. So, right, so uh, Electros kills... Eel kills Electivire. Now we have a free switch in. And I think I just go. I think I only just go Mule Tank. Mule Tank does well against most of this team. There's the cooking mama. So we can just go for a couple of body slams here. The thing is now that we are toxic. We will be toxic now. So Miltank does have a lot less longevity. A lot less staying power in this matchup. But we are just going to go for a body slam. She stays in. And the moonlight comes out. Um, so it, it's look it's not looking great. It, it's looking like we're going to get stalled out a little bit here. Um, and that's not to say that she's going to time us stall. Um, like some people come take that to mean. I just mean, obviously, all of our mons are going to be toxic now. She has moonlight. She has moonlight. Um, I'm just going to throw off the thunder wave. She does let her get her back up to full. She withdraws. She withdraws. And there's the Beyblade. So we get the, the Thunder Wave off on the, on the Beyblade again. 
Smart switch from her, to be honest. Smart switch. And we miss. Um, honestly, this is the sort of shit that just makes you want to not bother. Because <laughs> um, we've had ridiculously bad luck this season. Like, and that's actually just a joke. That uh, is actually just a joke. Um... I'm just going to go for it again. We hit it this time. Uh, honestly, it's just bollocks. <laughs> it's absolute bollocks. Um, we got... I'm trying to think of like the luck that we got, but... We got a... A para. And that's it. We've had nothing else. We've had no luck. Oh, and it's just... It's just really, really frustrating, to be honest. Um... See, milk tank's now getting low. Um, I'm just going to milk drink up this turn. Hope that she gets fully powered or something. I'm going to milk drink, milk drink up this turn. And then go out. Uh, we, are in, we are in trouble. <laughs> we are in trouble. I'm pissed, I'm pissed off that we're in trouble. Because we shouldn't be. Paralyzed, that's nice, right, okay. Bit of luck, bit of luck, thank you. Um, so we can now get Miltank out of there. We're just going to go into Scrafty. We're just going to go into Scrafty. We stay over half, which is nice. Um, well, actually, you know what, fuck it. Fuck it, we're going into Cloister, because this is the only way we win. This is the only way we win now. We're going into Cloister. We're going hard, Cloister. We take 25%. We get Toxic. Low kick. Um, and we don't even have our Z move on anyway. Uh, I'm just gonna go for an ice school spear. To be honest, I'm just gonna end it right now. Oh crap! Oh, crit. At least this thing's low. That's a low kick. And I think now we just go into guard trump. Or we go into Togekiss. No, we go into Togekiss. We save guard trump as last resort, to be honest. We save guard trump as last resort. We go Togekiss. Uh, we take our 25% from rocks. We throw off a wish, I think. I guess that's all we can do, really. Actually, I think we just let Togekiss go down. Um, I'm just going to go for Air Slash. Honestly, uh, this game is over. This game is over. Um, just going to try and play for differential. Um, I, ca I, can't, I, can't be mad. I can't be mad because I didn't get my team then. So, it's, it's my own fault. <laughs> Uh, it's my own fault. Um, uh, it's just it's it's frustrating, isn't it? It's frustrating when the last two weeks. Um, I mean, last week, last week less so, but actually no, let's no last week. Fuck off. The thunder wave, the thunder wave on the Weevil. If we landed that, we win. If we landed that, we win. I mean, I know Mega Gallade was still a problem. 
But there still wasn't a Weavile to sweep at the end. Um, and we did get a bit lucky with, like, the powers on Skarmory. But we, like, <sighs> that's not even to me. That's not even to me. Because we could have still taken the Skarmory out. The Weavile, as she switches out, goes into Rhapsody. Uh, so we are going to be able to take care of... Actually, no, she outspeeds. She outspeeds us. Um... Unless we've got a crit or something, but no. Um, obviously not. Uh, I kind of wish I threw off a wish. But no, actually no, because she outspeeds. There's no point. Um, I'm just going to go for another air slash. So we know that she outspeeds us, so... Uh, we're going down here. We are going down. Toga Kiss goes down. The blind prick... The blind prick. Um, now. I can't risk it being scuffed. I think I have to go mill tank. I have to go mill tank. And I'm just going to get the stealth rocks up. Earth power, so not scuffed, so that's good to know. Um, I mean, it's shit to know because uh, <laughs> we just sacked our mill tank. Um, but we do just go. We're just going to Garchomp now. Because we know we outspeed. And I think we just lock ourselves into Poison Jab. Because I think that's the play. We can't lock ourselves into anything else. Could lock ourselves into Stone Edge, but I don't, I don't see the point. So we reveal the Poison Jab. It should kill. We reveal the Poison Jab. Um, so, on the bright side, we, at the very worst, will be 1 and 3, 0. As the Nido Queen goes down. Um, at the very worst. Here comes the Beyblades. So let's just calc this. We are at minus one. Custom set. Uh, hit on top. Rapid spin. Intimidate. Um, I just changed its typing. For some reason. L50. Um, so minus one. A poison jab does nothing. Uh, I am just going to double out into Scrafty. Because that makes the most sense. As we are at minus one. Um, and we'll see what, sort of see what she wants to go for here. I don't think him on top gets Ice Punch. Actually, it should do. It should get Ice Punch. So, um, this is a good switch, I think. Can't move anyway. Um, so we are just going to set up a sub. I think we're going to set up a sub. Actually, no. We're going to go straight for the Iron Head. We're going straight Power Flinch on this bitch. Lives. The low kick comes in. Doesn't do much. I say doesn't do much. Um, we do have a Margot Berry to pop still. Uh, which still hasn't actually popped. <laughs> which still hasn't actually popped. Right, the Salamence is coming out here, I think. Represent uh, is the Sneak. No, it's, yeah, it's the Salamence. Uh, so the Intimidate drop comes in. That's actually fine. Um... Mago, 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 Mago. Um, I'm just gonna go for another Iron Head. I don't know what she wants to go for, to be honest. Yeah, I'm predicting that. I was predicting. 
I wish I say these things out loud. I we we saw earlier that a supersonic sky skystrike kills, obviously. Um, the thing is, uh, now obviously I'll go into Garchomp. Um, just just get rid of Scrafty. Scrafty about to die. Scrafty about to die. Um, bye, bitch. Bye. Uh, and we do just go to Garchomp. Um, and I think we just we just spam Stone Edge. I think we just spam Stone Edge. Uh, even though it does like it is just fourteen percent to a hit on top. And that's if we hit, which we probably won't because we are blind, team blind. Team blind memes. Um, but we are just going to try and get as much differential off as possible. Oh, so the smart the smart switch is Togekiss. Uh, not Togekiss, sorry. Hit on top. It's hit on top. Oh, I just realized I got rid of uh, the wrong one. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. There we go. There we go. Um, Chris? <laughs> Any chance, kid? Any chance? Um, I guess, uh, it would, does withdraw. Smart switch, smart switches. Yeah, they hit on top. Um, because I can't kill. Look, look at that damage. Look at that damage. Um, just kill me, please. <laughs> just kill me, please. Um, again, right, so, summary of the game, we did not get our mons, which, yeah, at the end of the day, you can't use, for the start, as a bad team in the first place, you can't use a bad team in the first place to try and beat another team that's not built for, the rough skin, oh my words, could we make it three, can we be one and three and still have a positive differential, can it happen? Can it happen? Oh, it lives. Para! Don't switch out. Don't save your differential. Please. Honestly, I'm just bad at Pokemon. Um, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Um, but I'm just bad, so, you know. It is what it is. As, as everyone likes to say. It is what it is. Um, but at this moment on time, I'm not even having fun anymore. Because we're just getting shit like this. <laughs> like, we do make it three. I hope I hope that kills. Yeah, it does. Right, that's good. That's good. So we, all, we will go one and three. Minus three. Uh, uh, minus three. One and three plus one. Um, so we are on a three loss streak. So uh, we need to turn this around. We need to turn this around. I'm not having fun because I'm not winning. Um, I'm a competitive person. Uh, and when you play, when you try and play competitively at a game that you're not very good at, it doesn't end well. Um, but as I said, we did have just a very, very hectic week. Honestly, like just didn't have the time. Just did not have the time. Uh, Destiny came out as well, which might not have helped the situation, but. Um, it, yeah, it is what it is. Um, let's just message Chris. Let's just message Chris. GG girl. I'm not going to say GG girl. GG pal. Um, it's just GG, man. Uh, yeah, good battle. Chris did well. Chris did very well to, to come out on top. Um, didn't even need to see the sneasel. Uh, there's not a lot to say. As I say, we... we we let ourselves down before the match even started. Um, the Togekiss is still blind. Everyone's blind, um, and the, I need to just find. I need to find a coach for this team that the team deserves. Because <laughs> I'm not doing them justice right now. I'm not doing them justice. I'm not even making bad plays. I don't think I'm making bad plays. 
I'm just, again, the prep wasn't there and the luck wasn't there. But, you know, who knows? You know, even if we did get all the luck in the world, we probably still wouldn't have won. So, um, you know, all, all, all credit to, to Chris, honestly. I'm not, I'm not going to take that away. Um, but, you know, we know what we need to do next week. We need to come out hard and we need to actually build properly. Yeah. Uh, luckily, no crazy shit went down this week. No stupid one nils where we miss an air slash. Crucial, and a crucial air slash. We, never, we didn't miss a crucial air slash. And we didn't break our DS. So uh, all's well that ends well as far as I'm concerned. Uh, we'll see you next week uh, where we are playing a team that I do not know because I haven't looked at the schedule yet. Let's look, let's, look, let's look right now. Let's look right now whilst we're here. I need to enter my stats in as well. Panther's shouting at me. Uh, schedule. Nuz, nice Megan Nuz leaves. So we are playing a Dutch. We are playing automatic. Nigel Megan, I think I probably I've butchered that probably, but still, um, we're playing him. Good battler, as far as I know. Still, <laughs> still king. Uh, so that that will be fun, and we're gonna have lots of fun. Uh, but at least we can do it in our own time zone. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. I've been Dan K Memes. Yeah, yeah, like and subscribe and stuff like that. And yeah, because we're in like twenty three subs. So uh, let's keep keep it keep it going. Keep it going. Peace.